I have a pretty active day planned for today. A few things that I want to do. I'm going to go to Agora, ancient Agora, the old marketplace. Can I just get a ticket to come in? One ticket, this. Just the Agora. Just the Agora. Yeah, yeah. 10 euros. 10 euros. That's great, thank you very much. This is like the beating heart of ancient Greece. Where Plato, Socrates and all these boys laid the groundwork, you know, for, for Western democracy and deep thinking philosophy you know to, to know thyself they used to preach that around here so I'm walking in the footsteps of these boys Temple of Hephaestus. Hephaestus was the the blacksmith god. Iron Man is loosely based on Hephaestus. So in the first Iron Man, when he's uh, captured, he's captured by terrorists, and he, he builds his first uh, Iron Man armor and goes out and beats them all around, batters them, kills a few of them, I think. So, there's a few uh, shots in that film where they kind of show him posing. And then if you look at the pictures or statues of Hephaestus, you can see the similarities, what they were doing there, you know. Superman is a mix of a lot of the different gods, apparently. Uh, especially Hercules. Hercules being the strongest, you know, kind of man of steel. I believe uh, most of the modern day superheroes, Marvel and that, you know, they're all based, well, loosely based on the gods, the Greek gods. Really nice. So, unlike the Parthenon, you can actually get very close to this one. So you get a much better picture. And it's still like intact, you know, that's the best thing about it. It looks almost exactly like it would have looked back then, two and a half thousand years ago. Stunning. The Acropolis up there. I was there yesterday and saw a beautiful sunset on the rock over to the right side. That's the museum there. That's not actually very old. They built this to look like the old temples and that just to fit in, you know. But apparently you get the real feel for it. It's, look at it. It's all marble. Victory of Crates in the Apophidus race at the Panathenaic Games. The Panathenaic Games is like the old Olympics, the original Olympics. I think it's time to go inside. 
Leaving mask on again. So that's what Acropolis originally looked like. When I came in yesterday, the band were playing right there. It's the Parthenon. Acropolis means high city. Like Acro means high and polis city, like metropolis, Indianapolis, polis means city. Did you know that? But you didn't. Well, some of you did. I only found it out. That's the temple of Hephaestus over there. So in 1899, this site found the largest number of ne ne Neanderthal fossil bones in Europe. Some 900 human remains, from about 80 individuals, Jesus. <laughs> looks a bit like Putin. He looks like a bit like Luke Kelly. If you don't know Luke Kelly, Luke Kelly was one of the original Dubliners, probably the greatest, um, greatest singer to ever come out of Ireland when it comes to Irish music. Yeah, that's it really. It's not that big, it's quite small. You'd want to give yourself uh, an hour maybe. An hour's enough, I'd say. You go into the museum there, you can see a lot of the old statues and that. There's not that much reading up on them either. Very little information because they don't actually know who a lot of them are. So I'm just leaving ancient Agora and I'm heading to the Temple of Olympian Zeus. Then after that I'm going on to the Panathenaic Olympic Stadium. It's about a 20 minute walk from here. Right.